highlighted three tunnels leading away from this cavern. Is any one of them connected to an exit? I cannot say. My senses are swamped by a large amount of biosignatures. Oh, yeah. Those are the parents of the crawlers you just blasted. They're probably fuming. What? You mean that those we just killed were the babies? Best not hang around. by the way. their prey by ejecting the acidic contents of their digestive tracts. So, it's that spit we're talking about? Not technically, no. Wow! Neat! Fantasy wealth. Back where we started. 
It was a nice route, though. about this one. Multiple crawlers are approaching. We are heading directly into a nest. Smarty talky voice, what else do you know about crawlers? Their diet consists mainly of a furry rat like species native to this area. That said, may I suggest throwing the Horag to the crawlers as a distraction? Come on, Ivy's just trying to look on the bright side. I fail to see the advantage of indiscriminate enthusiasm, but then again, I am not the one with a life to lose.
Is it just me, or does this route look like it's leading to an exit? It's the only tunnel we haven't checked so far, so it better be. familiar almost like coming back home the familiarity is due to us having visited here only recently really wow this place is like a quantum maze or something The structure in this area remains unstable. I recommend seeking a more viable route out of our current predicament.
That cracked wall looks promising. sent us both here to die? I was hanging up in that cave long enough to think it over good and hard. There's no doubt about it. Ha! Hey, Adam, you remember that time we got blitzed on Inari Starbase? Oh, hell yeah! Fond memories. I know what you're like, a wild man after a couple of Deb and Ash daiquiris. Hey! Where's my ride? No ship here, Alec. What? But... I very intentionally left it at a spot where I could see it from miles away. Yes, you and anyone else. I detect a civilian vessel on what appears to be a junk pile not too far away. I should take offense at that. Any idea who's been running cleanup crews out here? This could be the Okar. They prefer to keep the place tidy of new settlers. Oh man, the paint job alone cost me a fortune. Hive, keep an eye out for any Okar. I am constantly vigilant. Fumigating for fleas. Happy to reunite you two. I'll head over and get it running. I have comms on me so we can keep on talking in the meantime. Will I ever find peace again? So, Illich, what exactly did you do to piss off this Daryl guy enough to send you into a trap? Yeah, I'm gonna have to work that one out. Not sure exactly. How about you? I don't know. I was looking for a guy named Maddox. Maddox? The ramen chef that can't stand ramen? What? That guy? Yeah, the whole ramen thing is just a front for Mr. Kato's courier operation. Maddox uses it to fix illegal tech behind the counter and smuggle it across Prescott using his ramen delivery drones. In exchange, he gets hard to find parts from Mr. Cato's associates. Ah, damn it! They clamped my ride! A group of automated Oka units is approaching as we speak. Hey, look, can you unclamp it? Of course I can. Just give me a mo. I'll try to buy you some time. I am not here to settle or violate any treaties. I just need my 
ride back, okay? No dice, they're automated. Too dumb to understand a word you're saying. I've got to go back to Prescott and talk to Maddox for real this time. Who is this Mr. Cato you were talking about? My new boss on Prescott runs the big casino. Daryl is one of his underbosses. He has his hand in every pocket on Prescott, but no one is supposed to talk about it. Under any circumstances. Oh, scrap. Now I know why Daryl wanted rid of me. You'll have to count me out for now, Adam. Thanks for the rescue and all. I'd love to keep chatting about the good old days, but I gotta do some serious thinking about my next move. A few slam brewies on Bishop Starport ought to get my brain cells churning. I understand. Good luck to you, and thanks, buddy. It's good to see you again. I got your sig for when I need to find you. Take care, Illick. All right, Hive. Let's head back to Prescott and find that Maddox guy once and for all. Has he any idea that you're a clone? Give Alec a break. He's chaotic good. He operates on a different wavelength. Clearly a wonky wavelength. a den of vice and scummery. We've been through this. Let's just introduce ourselves to Maddox and hope he doesn't try to double-cross us again. Stay on its tail. 
Would you care to remind me why we are going through all this bother? I promised Dax that I would see this through. And this is a once-in-a-lifetime job. You are certainly putting a lot of effort into reaching this man who does not wish to be reached. I just want to talk. I'm out of here. No, wait. Uh, did he just lock us in? Yes. All the gates to this area are locked tight. Can't you just hack them open? Only the delivery drones possess the codes to do so. Figures.
Yes, the ship you were looking for is still here, very close by. Must be packing up. Better be careful. He's as slippery as they get. I could overclock your engines for a short period. This would prolong your boost capabilities, but could severely threaten the ship's stability and devices. Good to know, but no use until I manage to catch up with him. the Raman Chef's last known coordinates on the HUD. That must be the guy. Go get him. Uh, who are you again? How about changing your strategy from naive questioning to evasive action? I have indicated the Raman Chef's last known coordinates on the HUD. That must be the guy. Go get him. Uh, who are you again? How about changing your strategy from naive questioning to evasive action? still be valid.
There he is. Maddox, stop! Hive, overclock my boosts. Now! Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. Maddox, stop! i overclock my boosts. Now! Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. Darius, Maddox, stop! I overclock my boosts now. Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. Scrap. I lost it. Maddox, stop! I overclock my boosts. Now! Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. Darius, Maddox, stop! I overclock my boosts now. Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. Darius, Maddox, stop! I overclock my boosts now. Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all... Maddox, stop! 
Hive, overclock my boosts. Now! Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. He's trying to lose us in here. He and an entire battalion of outlaw mercenaries, it seems. Don't tell me these are all your guys, Maddox. Maddox! Stop! Hive, overclock my boosts. Now! Activated unlimited boosting. Deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. He's trying to lose us in here. He and an entire battalion of outlaw mercenaries, it seems. Don't tell me these are all your guys, Maddox. They are. Came with the job. The smuggling thing? You really ask too many questions, kid. Was that the first question I ever asked him? It may have been. He's really not listening at all. Thank you. 
Matt! Max, stop! Hive, overclock my boost. Activated unlimited boosting, deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? You killed him, didn't you? No, you're getting me all wrong. I'm on your side. I can do this. I've got this. Maddox, stop! Overclock my boosts, now! Activated unlimited boosting, deactivated devices. Maddox, listen. I don't know how to make it any clearer to you. I ain't your type. Dax asked me to find you. It's the truth. Then what's the code word? I don't know. He died before he could tell me. He's dead? like an insignificant insect. Scram, you scrapping tools.
Stardust. blasted a bunch of his squad. Ah, don't worry. They're just hired mercenaries. Expendable. I'm in good with Mr. Kato. You sure about this? Yeah, come on. Let's go see the boss. Spider's meal of you. Yeah, and he owes me payment for that job. Besides, I can't really touch him because he's Mr. Kato's nephew. Elec, what are you getting me into? Relax, buddy. It'll be fine.
still naked walking into a situation like this without a few tons of ship wrapped around me. It'll all be good. Just act cool and follow my lead. Mr. Alec, you were not expected. Are you flirting with me again, Marianne? Me and my associate here would like a word with the boss. Something not, not ex expected. She's crazy about me, really. Get down! Damn it! What are you guys doing? Stop it! Daryl! Give me that remote! You idiot! Alec, you okay? All good, boss. Who the hell is this guy? This is Adam, boss. I brought him in for a chat. He wanted to ask a favor. A favor? You guys are giving me nothing but headaches today. Get inside, all of you! Now let's figure out what's going on, in a civilized manner. Daryl, why the hell did you do this to Alec and his associate? Because they've been nothing but a pain in the ass. We barely made it out of that spider cave alive. You owe me for that. Hey, yeah, me too. <laughs> why did you do that without even asking me? The, the guy's been sniffing around after Maddox. Yeah, and who are you exactly? You should know Maddox is under my protection. I just wanted to talk to him. I'm not a bounty hunter, just a friend of a friend. Uh-huh. And you know Alec how, exactly? Oh, me and Adam go way back, before we even met, boss. He's a hotshot pilot. I've never seen anything like him. Is that so? But I'm still not too impressed by your imposition into my business. We should just phase him. Shut up! I have to apologize for my nephew. He's still learning the ropes of the business. Saki? Well, really, Daryl should be apologizing for himself. Daryl! I'm sorry I sent you guys to your certain deaths, okay? See? All's good and better now. For every problem, there's a lesser problem with a sort of solution, right? Anyway, you guys interrupted my meal with all your antics. These two guys have been at each other's throats since... <clears throat> the short furry one showed up. I don't think there's anything I can do to reconcile them. Ty liked the little guy, but Daryl is family. I'm gonna have to find a way to separate them. So, rather than taking the crude and uncultured path of violence, I'd like to make you a little proposition. I can arrange a meeting with Maddox, but I need you to do a little job for me in return. Do you savvy? As long as it's quick. And something a little more sensitive. You need to take the little furry guy off my hands, too. I understand. Don't worry. I can get him out of your hair. He's not so bad. Hey, I know that. I'm just trying to find amicable solutions. That's my job. But you do understand that there are consequences. If you disappoint me. Likewise. All right. I like this guy's style. What do you know? A real kindred spirit knows his stuff. This time I'll be giving the delivery orders, so there'll be no funny business. Right, Daryl? Right, boss. Okay, so this is the deal. You deliver a little package for me from A to B, and I'll let you know where to find Maddox. So it's a smuggling run. Ooh, now that's one nasty word. 
better not let the Okar hear it. They're quite touchy about uncertified cargo moving in and out of their territory. Touchy to a degree, where they just shoot anyone who tries to pass through Smuggler's Wheel and ask questions later. So I recommend getting yourself a distraction for them. I've been told I make a great distraction. That you do, Alec. That you do. Oh, I'm gonna miss having you around. What do you mean? I'll explain later. So where do we start? Meet my contact at the black market in the underbelly. They'll fill you in on the rest. It was a blast having you. Bye-bye, Alec.